Welcome to Sports News. We'll begin from the local scene. Newly promoted Abia Warriors bolstered their title aspirations after romping to a 4-1 win over Aqua United in the midweek match of the Glow Premier League. Striker Chisom Chikatara shot Abia Warriors ahead early in the game. Chima Uluacha increased the goal tally from the penalty spot. A few minutes later, after Peter Onyekachi was brought down by Charles Ovat, Inyakban pulled one back for Aqua United also from the penalty spot. But from this point, it became a one-sided affair as Peter Onyekachi handed Abia Warriors a third goal before Chikatara completed his brace in injury time. He has a good left foot. He plays with both feet. But uh, his favorite foot is the left. Walks up gently to that one and he takes it, deceives the goalkeeper completely. And uh, well, Joseph Onoa had just went the wrong way. And here the Warriors come again as a true passer. He's aside. He will score. And uh, that will score and it's 3 1. It is 3 1. Peter Onyekachi. In Europe, Spain striker Diego Costa has passed a medical at Chelsea ahead of a proposed £32 million transfer from Atletico Madrid. Chelsea met the buyout clause in the 25-year-old's contract with Atletico and will now negotiate personal terms. Costa scored 36 goals in 52 games for Atletico this season as they won their first La Liga title since 1996 and reached the Champions League final. The Brazil-born forward is in Spain's World Cup squad. Well, soccer fans waited in line at World Cup ticketing points across Brazil, hoping to get their hands on last-minute tickets released by FIFA. FIFA released 180,000 tickets in the early hours of today for the matches beginning on June the 12th. Within an hour of going on sale on the internet, all tickets for the final, semi-finals and the opening match were sold out. To tennis now, world number one Rafael Nadal had to come from a set down in the quarterfinal of the French Open to defeat compatriot David Ferrer 4-6-6-4. 6-love, six 6-1. Six With his place in the semi-finals under threat, Nadal dug deep to win the second set and produced a near-flawless performance to take the third and fourth sets. The 28-year-old will be seeking to successfully defend his title and add to his 13 Grand Slams. He'll face Britain's Andy Murray, who defeated Frenchman Gael Monfils 6-4, 6-1, 4-6-1-6, 6-love. Six six six, six Love 15. Love so 30. Close. Are you trying to say that the body is holding up now just because he's five <laughs> <love> up? <laughs> Zero counts. Jogging between points now, got it all there. Ready. And in the women's category, Simona Halep is through to the semi-finals of the French Open. The Romanian justified her ranking with a 6-2, 6-2 demolition of Svetlana Kuznetsova in the quarter-finals. Halep will now face Andrea Petkovic of Germany for a place in the final. Petkovic defeated clay court specialist Sera Erani 6-2, 6-2. The German is appearing at the French Open for the first time since reaching the quarterfinals in 2011. Once this Game set and match on Sports News. Back to Bimbo for the rest of the news at 10.